Hi everyone. Continue to pray for my health and pain, our finances. If anyone can help us financially, just let me know. Um, for Deem, his joints, Benji, he's been messing with his foot. It's hair coming off of it. It's all red. I don't know what's wrong with him. Can't afford to take him to the vet. So pray for him. My friend Polly and her finances, Aaron, his finances, homeless, orphans. Um, my friend Harlan, he's going through some stuff. My friend Bobby's health. If you have prayer, please let me know. Letting Go and Trusting God, 180 Devotions for Life's Tough Decisions by Pamela L. McQuaid. Peaceful living. Hold on. Do your best to live at peace with everyone. Romans 12, 18. Living peacefully is a choice. One we sometimes cannot manage if the other party is unwilling to bury the hatchet. That's why God only commands us to do our best to live peacefully. But often, since a soft answer turneth away wrath, Proverbs 15, 1. A lack of confrontation could bring a surprising amount of peace to relationships. As we look at a warlike world, living at peace may seem impossible, and left to human minds and hearts, it would be. People tend to jump into action against enemies, pushing weapons in their faces. But with God and decisions that reflect his will, we can begin to find peace with some. Where we cannot find peace, at least we can limit our own sinful actions and know that we have made our best efforts to obey Paul's counsel. Contentious co-workers, neighbors, and even friends may never, never leave our lives entirely, but by living by biblical guidelines, we can deal with them more effectively. And when our abilities fail, God can still work wonderfully in our lives and in those of our neighbors. The neighbors across the way may still aim his snowblower at the end. The neighbor across the way may still aim his snowblower at the end of your driveway, but the town's plow will still carry it away. Your nerves may strain when a coworker takes advantage of you yet again, but God will help you keep your cool. There is always a way to try to live at peace, and that's all God asks of you. Hope everyone has a blessed rest of their Monday. God bless.